Disclaimer alert. Disclaimer alert. Everybody is Dr. Joe. Today I'm going to show you some pulmonary breathing exercises for things such as COPD or just to increase your lung capacity if you're a swimmer or if you're a surfer and you want to be able to hold your breath for longer. So let's get started. So with the breathing exercises you want to always inhale through your nose and exhale through your mouth. With your mouth you don't want to make kissy face but you want to purse your lips when you're breathing out. So the first thing you want to do is breathe in through your nose for two seconds and then you're going to purse your lips and then blow out for four seconds. So pretty sexy, huh? Now just do that about 10 times to get the oxygen flowing and then you're going to start making some movements with your arms to loosen up the muscles in your chest area as well. So the first one with your arm moving, bring your hands into clasped in front of you and you're going to actually move at your trunk. So you're going to take in a big breath and then while you're doing your movements, you're going to breathe out. So big breath in and out. Keep doing that as long as you're breathing out until you get to the end of the level and then do that five times. After that, then we're going to do the chicken wing. So bring your arms up to your shoulders and same thing. Big breath in through your nose and while you're breathing out, makes me feel like I'm at a wedding doing the chicken dance. Now after all that's nice and loosened up, you can try some breathing through your diaphragm and that's actually breathing in the stomach area instead of your chest area and a good way to know that you're breathing with your diaphragm is put your hands on your stomach like this if your fingers aren't moving back and forth then you're breathing up in your chest area so try and make your hands move did you hear that noise Somebody must be hungry. Same thing, do that about five times. And then the very last thing is a very interesting, kind of embarrassing one. My brother claims that guys can't do it, but I think it's just because he can't do it. So what you're gonna do, this is gonna be a forceful breathing out. And what you're doing is you're just trying to get all the air out of your lungs, even in the reserved area. And then once you forcefully get all of it out, you're gonna hold your breath and kind of suck in. And it's actually gonna make a little dimple here. So if you're doing it right, it'll almost feel like a vacuum in your throat. So you're gonna do this. Breathe in and blow out. <laughs> and just hold that as long as you can. When you let go, it'll make a really interesting kind of suction noise and that's getting all of it out. Hold it as long as you can, but since you're on the breathing out, it probably will only be a few seconds. Woo, after all that holding and breathing, I feel like I'm gonna pass out. I hope you don't feel like you're gonna pass out. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section. If you'd like to check out some other videos, go to askdrjoe.com. Don't forget to follow me on Facebook and remember, be safe. Have fun, and I hope you feel better soon.